How do you do, ma'am? Well, thank you. Please have a seat and I'll be right with you. Thank you. I would love to see guys like you. Are you from here? Yeah, I actually grew up maybe about a mile away from here. Uh, my family specializes in gritty ingredients for beer. <laughs> Including the ones that make people do that. Ah, so you got some brewer blood in you. Looks like I might actually have a challenge. Hey, no pressure here. Just hit me with your best shot. Alrighty, let's do this. Uh... I think you should keep looking. Like, right now. Why? No, oh, sir. Uh, uh, why are you acting so intense right now? See that chair? That's my property. You crossed over. I'm oh, sorry. I thought the beer on the other seat was yours. Where I come from, there's only one way to settle scuffles like these. Oh, God. Are you going to kill me? What? No. We're going to settle this in the most fair way possible. Well, here's my way of settling it. I'm gonna go find myself a box seat. Bullshit! Vermin, draw. Lucky break again. Again. How is this freaking possible? No one's ever lasted in a three-round match with me. First for everything, partner. Hey, if you want to call it a day... Shut your mouth, Cheat. I told you, we ain't leaving until we have a clear winner. Sue yourself. <sighs> this... Is getting nowhere. Oh, let's just call it in. Screw you. I said we ain't leaving until one of us falls. <laughs> Is he? Nah, he's fine. Just being dramatic. Ah! Well, I gotta say, quite a feat of you to defeat the great John Lotaro. He hadn't lost a single match. Well, not really shocking to me. You see, my pa always told me that when people get drunk with the good stuff, they slip into arrogance. Well, amen to that. Come back inside, champ. 
everything's on the house for you tonight. I appreciate that, man, but that won't be necessary. Thank you.